What's going on guys? Pistol Pack and Pilot back with another video and this is not a video I want to be making but you guys asked me to keep you informed so that's what I'm here to do. I cannot believe that it is happening this fast yet here we are. We now have a fifth airline pilot that has fallen ill, or died while on duty. And this time, it happened yet again right here in the good old U.S. of A. We're going to talk about that right now. So first thing I'm referencing is going to be a tweet from Josh Yoder. Josh Yoder is another airline pilot, and he also runs U.S. Freedom Flyers. So when something happens, he gets a ton of phone calls. And earlier this morning, this video is being made on March 22nd. He tweeted, I'm being notified by passengers on a Southwest flight departing Las Vegas that the captain became incapacitated soon after takeoff this morning. He was removed from the flight deck and replaced by a non-Southwest pilot who was commuting on that flight. I'm going to be referencing an article from View from the Wing and Essentially, it states that a pilot had a medical emergency. We're talking about Southwest Airlines Flight 6013. It was a flight from Las Vegas to Columbus, Ohio. The Boeing 737 initially departed on schedule. They took off, they flew northeast, flew out over Utah, and then they made a U-turn and went right back to Las Vegas. And initially, you might think, well... This, this is just a rumor that one of the pilots fell ill or had God knows what happened to him or her in flight. But this is now confirmed with a statement from Southwest Airlines. Southwest has stated, Southwest Flight 6013 from Las Vegas to Columbus, Ohio, returned to Las Vegas after departure on Wednesday when one of our pilots needed medical attention. The flight landed safely, and an alternate flight crew is operating the flight to Columbus. We commend the crew for their professionalism and appreciate our customers' patience and understanding regarding the situation. So after this happened, the pilot was incapacitated to the degree that he or she could not even operate the flight. The second pilot had a commuting pilot. This is just a guy who's jump seating. He's either commuting to work or he's commuting home. He's hitching a ride. He's a, he's a hitchhiker on an airplane, basically. That pilot summoned that commuting pilot into the flight deck, who was not a Southwest Airlines pilot, and that pilot assisted the other pilot with radio communications and pilot monitoring duties while the pilot who became incapacitated was being tended to by medical professionals. Now, that pilot of the Southwest Airlines flight would have been fully capable of landing the airplane safely and getting the plane on the ground without the assistance of that second commuting pilot in the back of the aircraft. However, that did make his job a little bit easier. There's no word on if that other pilot was type rated on the Boeing 737 or not, but he was another airline pilot and he was able to assist in this emergency. So guys, this is now the fifth incident this month. The fifth incident of a pilot becoming incapacitated and seriously ill and or dying while on duty. Today is March 22nd, so we're talking about just barely over a three-week period. We are averaging more than one pilot per week. That would be like, what, 1.7 pilots per week? 
either falling ill or dying while on duty? This has never, ever happened before. These times are unprecedented. I have to be very careful what I say here, but I think we all know what the one single common denominator is. And it's it's very sad and it's very scary. And I truly think we, we haven't seen the peak yet, guys. I think it's gonna continue to get worse. I hope and pray I'm wrong, but uh, I, I have my doubts on this one. So thoughts and prayers to the Southwest pilot who fell ill today. I hope and pray that he's okay and he recovers quickly and he makes it back to the flight deck. I really hope that I don't have to make any more of these videos, but I suspect I'm probably gravely wrong and I suspect there will be more of these videos coming because this has become our new normal. Thanks for watching, guys. I am the pistol packing pilot and I am out. See ya.